Now to an update on a story that made national headlines after the mysterious death of a family's two Great Danes. Tonight, we now know how the dogs died. The autopsy results showing both dogs were drugged. And real quickly, let me give you a recap of this story. Back in June, we introduced you to Bill Irvin, who you see here. He was in the process of moving his family from Michigan to California. He hired a Topeka company called VIP Pet Delivery to move their two Great Danes, as well as their cat. The animals were picked up in Michigan, but by the time they arrived in California, the dogs were dead. Only the cat survived. The family was given no explanation from Rachel Cottrell, the owner of the now shut down pet delivery service based in Topeka, and I contacted her back in June. She told me she hired another carrier to transport the family's pets, but never made the family aware another company had taken over. So I contacted that company, Ship Pets Online. They told me they had no idea how the dogs died. The autopsy shows both dogs were injected with a drug, and one of the dogs had also been injected with a horse tranquilizer. Now, I spoke with Bill Irvin earlier today and asked him why the driver would have injected his dogs with these drugs. He told me his vet believes it was to knock the dogs out so they wouldn't have to stop while making that cross-country trip. Now, both dogs were given too much, which is what ended up killing them. You can read more about what he told me as well as why legally they haven't been able to hold anyone accountable in this whole situation. We have all of that for you online. Just go to KSNT.com and click on this story.